<laughs> saw this on Twitter. Oh. This is what the doctors are going to find when they open up Mitch McConnell. Oh. <laughs> From Men in Black. <laughs> if you know, you know. Josh! Hey, welcome back to our Stupid Rex of Corbin. I'm Rick. You can follow us on Instagram, Twitter for juicy content. Thank you to everybody sports on Patreon. Follow us to the account, subscribe to the like button. And our in, and R I P Sinead O'Connor. Oh yeah, jeez, that was that was a out surprise. of nowhere. Out of just truly out of and Awful. young. I mean, I, I know she had had health issues, and the, the, the only news is that it was not foul play, which is great. My suspicion is she had an underlying health condition. And, oh, so sad. Yeah. Anyways, today we got a new trailer for Godard 2. Hey, cool. Uh, this is a, a big... This, so this was a... Um, the Godard one, which we haven't seen yet, uh, came out in, I believe, the 90s. And it, it was a huge, huge hit. Right. Huge hit. And it was Sunny. I'm sunny, trying to remember. Sunny Joel. I'm trying to remember because stupid babies were messaging me and I saw comments on, on our first thing about this because we were asking if we need to see the first one. Mm -hmm. I'm trying to remember what they said. Well, it's basically, um, yeah, yeah. A lot of them were like, yeah, watch yeah. it. But also, because uh, it's nostalgia, especially for 90s babies. Right. Really they watch it. But it's okay. also... Like Sonny Joel, even though he's not a superhero, he's basically like the Hulk. <laughs> right. So, like, so he, he has uh, this massive strength. Also, it's very patriotic. It's India Pakistan tension. And right. So it's it's very patriotic for a lot of people as well. Um, so they said you could go in for a lot of fun mm. in the first one. Uh, but obviously, we haven't seen it yet, but this one came out. Uh, so the spoiler it's is. It's coming out that, soon. Yeah, the 11th. Yeah. Same day as Jailer, same day as OMG2. Wow. I don't know and Animal was supposed to come out that day, but then they right, they it moved to, it to December. Big day, I guess. I guess it's right before Independence Day. Maybe that's why. That would make sense. Yeah. But anyways, I guess the spoiler is uh, Godard didn't die in the first. One. <laughs> <laughs> guess so. Uh, but also, I guess that's not a huge spoiler. Uh, they usually don't kill off the the main guy in, yeah. in films. Yeah, oftentimes. Uh, but anyways, let's just get into it. Unless, of course, you have a multiverse and you can just do whatever you want and people can die and you can just bring them back in another multiverse forever. Wow. Delhi is ours. Good night. Who is that? Why do I know that guy?
must have been something from the first one that yeah was that, that we, an easter egg like the water dripping yeah he's just looking at a pipe is that yeah, is must, that pipe on the other side of the border it, or it must be something from the first one yeah it's got to be that's a weird frame to to end on um, well yeah the standout is the sledgehammer through geez. the face <laughs> that was <laughs> that was <awesome>. phenomenal <laughs> um it felt like a 90s trailer actually yeah it like did. in terms of like they they're I mean, I know the film came out in the 90s. So maybe they were trying to make it feel similar to the whatever. Exactly. I, mean, I don't know, because we haven't seen the film. That's yet. my suspicion based on that. It felt very, like, extremely patriotic, India, yeah. Pakistan. It's Jai Hind, man. It's, it's Independence um, Day. It's going to have a lot of that feeling to yeah. it, I think. I mean, especially coming out on Independence Day, that's probably what they're, Absolutely. they're hoping on. Yep. And obviously the, the nostalgia of the character um, and, and stuff like that. It just, it felt... Like in terms of formulaic, it felt very '90s. I, that's all. I, not not like it's a good or bad thing. It's just it just that's what it felt like. the The trailer I think could have probably been cut a little better. It did feel choppy. It did feel a bit um, choppy. I, I did. I did really enjoyed that sledgehammer part. I did too. <laughs> so that was awesome. Yeah. Um, but yeah, I, obviously. How are you, for those who know the yeah. character and have seen the first film, how does this trailer sit with you? In, in the comments, let us know if this is something you're excited for, if it falls short of what you were expecting, because we are not going to... We're giving you a reaction that's based on a lot of ignorance around yeah. th and this, you know? That's one of the things that I had uh, fears of uh, with Kieran Johar's new film, which we'll see how that goes, right? But I, I have high hopes, because I think he's going to go a little more modern. But I was like, so if Kieran Johar is doing an ode to old Bollywood, mm. is he going to have that same style of old Bollywood? Will that work now? Right. Same with this. Will that 90s style, will nostalgia be enough to bring people in and also keep them entertained in yeah. 2023? Yeah. I don't know. Um, that I, I do know. I've heard a lot about, like, in terms of people's excitement, because I think they like the, the original film a lot. Yeah, the closest I could give to it is, I mean, this is a, a, a grand, you know, a grand comparison, but of film, another film that recently came out that had a huge gap between when it was released and when the sequel was made was Top Gun. And it, it I felt they did a great job. One of the many attributes that are worth applauding in, in Top Gun Maverick was that it gave you some of those exact same vibes from the original, especially right at, from the very beginning. It just picks up right where it left yeah. off. And it gives you a lot of those same vibes, <clears throat> but it is contemporary. Yeah. So, um, And I, I think in the last one, I, I said it was Sonny Dole because I thought he was the same guy from um, Love Hostel, the, the bad guy. Right. That's his brother. Oh, no wonder. It was Bobby Dole. Bobby Dole. Duh. Sonny Joel is his brother. Yes. <laughs> it's confusing. <laughs> Nepotism. We're still we're still uh, learning. But we ha I think we've seen like a something with Sonny Joel. I could be wrong. Uh, I just I don't know what that would be. Um, but yeah, looks it, it could be interesting. Obviously, I think you would definitely probably need to, especially to get the. Oh, we'll have to see when the film comes out. To get to the feel and the the nostalgia factor and the uh, love for the characters that, that yeah it seems like they're uh, it's a major continuation yeah it's a, that's just the feeling I get right? yeah like I said those of you who saw the original really interested to know what you think about the trailer if it if it meets your expectations if you think it felt flat and especially I guess without spoilers <laughs> what's the what's the water faucet yeah what's the thing going on there it seems like a a very important thing to be showing. Yeah, especially at the end of the trailer, like, remember this? Or, I don't, did he, I don't know. I have no idea. Uh, anyways, let us know what you thought about Godard 2 trailer. And if you're excited, if you're going to go to it, which one are you going to see? That's a, originally if Animal was out, man, that would have been See them all. Films, Jailer, uh, this, OMG 2. See them all. And then Animal, but not anymore. Barbenheimer them. Maybe. Uh, anyways, let us know what you thought about it down below. Just 